So I'm back at Hancock Antique Mall. Uh, just going on a little road trip down the road. Got some lunch. And now I stopped in here. Ruben's Land Planner. Paint seems to be in really good condition. I don't see any chips. They want $12 for it. I don't... I don't see a booth discount in here. So I don't know. I'm going to think about that. I just got in here. This isn't the first section I've hit. And then if you're curious about the little train... Um... It's $5, and it is a music box. These are the ones I like here. The, the floral frog, 18 for that yeah. one. 14, and yet I already stabbed my finger. So SH is having a 60% off sale. So I'm gonna look a little bit closer at a couple of things. She has a good many dolls, which I know nothing about, but I just figured they were right in front of me. I would show you. I like the Haggy Witch. $35.99. There's some bling back there. If I can squeeze through this table for stuff. Oh, suck it in, girl. Oh, my. Look at that. Gorgeous. Wow. definitely newer um i don't know what the price is there's a peacock that goes to that 57 for oh my i would never carry i mean it's it's probably three pounds easily i would never carry anything like that but it does fancy sixty six ninety and i guess sixty percent off i like the handle on that so just fanciness. Hearts. Oh, I have him. I have this right here. I got it at Target years and years ago. What? $90. Mm, yeah. I guess it could be vintage. It's as bad as old as my daughter, so... I guess it kind of meets the modern vintage mark. This is the booth that had some fun Easter stuff the last time I was here. So I'm just going to take a check and look now to see if there's anything worth picking up. As things transition into summer, I'm just not as, tract as attracted to things as I normally would be. So it's hard for me to justify a lot of prices. So it seems not much has changed since the last time I was here, but this was the booth that I really, really liked. Um, so I'm just looking to see what they have. This planter here, I've seen these before. The AB planters with the flowers, $4. The owls are still here. There's some drink picks, $6 each. It's a Hazel Atlas Creamer for 5 glass oh that one is too it looks almost like it could be plastic for eight funeral glass dish for five there's that little framed glass print still here it is four dollars still cute uh, a couple cards Beads, two dollars. Some Smurfs for three. I do like these patriotic glasses. For Betsy Ross, twenty-two dollars. It has the ribbed middle. Some Pyrex. Hard to believe it is May. Finally, warmer weather. Oh, there's a sippy cup for five dollars. Look at all these party horns. Four dollars. 
three. So I'm going to dig through here. See what all they got. I might have to get one of these, especially like the blue or the red. Uh, perfect for um, patriotic holiday for display coming, you know, for the summer. A little bag of Christmas for three fifty. This bag here is for a dollar. Look at this bling! Wow, for ten dollars. What does that say? Mall watch. They couldn't miss you coming into town with that one. Okay, that's a little creepy. The frame is $4. Masquerade picture. I wonder if it's vintage or not. That It's just a piece of like a, you know, taking off the copier and just put in there. There's an egg for three fifty. So I did some damage with those metal uh, noisemakers because her booth is 50% off and this is as well. Same code. So now I'm over here looking to see what uh, I can pick up. There's another one. So some of them are three, four, and five. And I got a couple cool ones. Oh, look. Hey, there's those party favors. Like, oh, these are rings though. Like the one I picked up. With the little bells on it. And then this one is heels. High heel shoes. So it'd be 50 cents each. I like the little blocks. Stay stay there. I like the little um, vintage blocks. $7. So it'd be three fifty. There's a bigger pack. For 10 Corn holders. Oh, I could use those. I really could, but a lot of times I just cut my corn off, so they'd probably just sit in my drawer. Oh, some tins. 18. These are 14. The grapes. There's cookie cutters, a bunt pan. I was looking over here through the ephemera and cards. This Girl Scout wrapping paper would be a dollar fifty. The Fenton Silvercrest bowl is ten at half price. Eagle December Angel with repaired wings, two dollars. It would be a dollar. That is. Oh, and the halo's chipped. Back you go. Oh. I've always wanted one of these. Letter, um, you know, I can put the receipts on it. It'd be ten. I'm going to have to think about that. There's this one. And this one. Alright, thinking about those. There's a cheese box. How much do they want for it? 20 okay so it'd be 10 That's, I can find them usually better than that oh I see more molds I did not see these the first time around the hearts would be 350 more bunt little um candle candle tins 13 so what 750 no 650 Some more ephemera over here. Three dollars. There's some uh, freezer boxes, two fifty each. You see a lot of assemblages made with these. I think there's two in there. 
That's a pretty good deal. Now I just gotta decide which one do I want. That one's a little more crooked, doesn't really matter though. Oh, decisions, decisions. I love looking through old wrapping paper. That's current for a dollar the bunnies. Oh, the flowers are nice. A dollar. Bob, it says 80s. I don't see any really one that's just saying, get me. Oh, that's nice. The old uh, wedding, wedding paper. Be five dollars for the bag. Looks like um an old um cigarette tin, tobacco tin, made into a swan or duck. However you want to look at it. I went for the green, the receipt holder, and then those are all the um noisemakers, which I already showed that, but so it'd be ten dollars. I don't know why I want one. I just do. It's not like I would ever poke a hole in my good scrap paper with it. Holiday delights. Kind of coming down to the last hour and that's all I have so far. It's been fun looking at things though. Incense burners, $2. Lust to wear teacup for two dollars. I also really like this booth. It was is back in the corner. LNS Treasures. So they have a lot of little figurines in the uh, plastic containers. But this is where I also I think I found something Eastery back here, which they still have a lot of Easter stuff left. And an egg for nine. 88. Same thing, I back into something. It's tight back here. 998 for the little doggies. Hugger for five. These are all huggers. Little bunny hugger. Yikes, look at this baby. Oh, eight dollars. No, thank you. I was looking at these patio lights. There's seven. Okay, I know this is newer stuff, but I still have a weakness for it all. The metal garland, 450. There's some dummy boards. They are 650. Bethany Lowe designs and that one there yeah 650 not much into the gnomes 798 for that one parent is by Kathy I do like that metal garland, but it looks like it's only 13, 14 inches long. Let's see what else they got. Oh, there's that one. These are 298. There's some Pitberry garland for 10. the farm animals oh I like that the hardware tin I think it comes with a lid yeah toolbox 15 that's really neat it's a little bit thin but it's still neat oh and I like that post office box I'm gonna try to work myself back there so 
That's definitely newer. It's gotta be. Now it's five ninety eight. I'm not sure about that, but I think it is newer. Just a reproduction. Ooh, I like the poultry feed sign, fifteen ninety eight. I thought those were um, like Hershey candles. I've had a Hershey candle before, but they're just a candle and a sign from Primitives by Kathy. There's some more tins down there. So this is it. I'll be wrapping it up here. I just want to show you this oil jar. It's Avon and guess what? There's liquid in it or I would definitely get that. That's cool. Five dollars for this little basket. Oh, I wonder who makes it. But that's it. I only got my noise makers and my little receipt holder. I don't see anything else. So I will talk to you guys again really soon. Baking cups for 50 cents. 50 cents.